Hi guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. If you take quilting as a passionate hobby, then you have to watch this video. Today we have two of the biggest names in the niche to see who does it better. This is Jordan Fabric vs Missouri Star Quilt Company. But before we begin, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell and let's begin with the video. With this aside, let's get started. Jordan Fabrics joined YouTube on the 3rd of October 2015 and they made their first upload about 6 years ago while the Missouri Star Quilts Company joined YouTube back on the 18th of February 2009 and they made their first upload about 13 years ago. The Missouri Star Quilts Company is 7 years ahead of the Jordan Fabrics. Despite this astronomical difference, Jordan Fabrics is picking up pretty quickly with only about 240,000 subscribers away. Being on YouTube for more than a decade has its perk. The Missouri Star Quilt Company has about 1,200 videos uploaded to date, while Jordan Fabrics is at 342 videos to date. There is a huge difference in stats as the Missouri Star Quilt Company got 1.88 million views in the last 30 days, while Jordan Fabrics clocked at a staggering 1.2 million in the last 30 days. With that being said, Jordan Fabrics can make somewhere around four to five hundred dollars a day, which could translate to at least about three grand a week. They could earn about twelve grand a month. Missouri Star Quilt Company gets about five hundred to seven hundred dollars a day, which could rise to about four point five grand a week, making their monthly earnings at least twelve grand a month. And these are just from ad revenue. Now, with all of these aside, let's analyze their channel. We all know that Jordan Fabrics are the pioneers in quilting, and they have been among the first ones to popularize the hobby, turning it into an art form. They started with humble beginnings, and they have managed to grow into an amazing business. I'm sure they were the ones who put quilting to where it is now. They run an amazing family business. The Missouri Star Quilts Company is commercially successful with over 400 employees and I'm sure that their quilting army is a force to reckon with. But the Jordans surely tackle quality over quantity. Donna has this personality that captivates anyone who watches her. There is no doubt that she's a great host. Whenever I see her videos, I feel like it's not a tutorial, but rather a let's learn together sort of a video. This approach makes it a lot more interesting and we can relate more to the content. The Missouri stars jump straight into the video and they just do their job. Jordan's videos get much more interactive. That goes a long way on YouTube. If you're starting and you're a complete beginner, then Missouri stars videos provide great information. But after you're a little more seasoned, Jordan Fabrics will have unique designs for you to craft. Jordan Fabrics are very serious about their craft and anything you buy from them, I'm sure will be something handmade. They put their time and effort into the job, and that is what makes them so special. They aren't worried about making money, and all they focus on are the quality of the things they have in store. Missouri Star Quilt Company, on the other hand, is commercially successful, as they have innovative ways to promote themselves. They feature many other quilters and designers on their channel, which is a great way to promote themselves. They also host live shows, where they interview and discuss various topics. Missouri Stars have over 400 employees, which tell me that they are contributing a lot to Hamilton's economy. So yeah, if you're just starting as a quilter, then Missouri Star Quilt Company is the channel that you should see. But if you are on an intermediate level, then Jordan Fabric is the channel to be in. If you're just a beginner, then Missouri Star Quilt Company is your go-to channel. But if you have the idea of what you're going to do with the quilting, then Donna Jordan is the lady. Anyway, what do you think about both of these content creators? Let the viewers know in the comment section below. In my opinion, both individuals have their distinctive styles and aesthetics. Subscribe for more and don't forget to like the video and slap that notification bell. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't seen them yet, we'll leave a link to their channel in the description box. Take care, stay safe and we'll see you in the next one.